Hey everybody, so I was sitting down and I was going to do a pick a pile, but um, today with all of the energies going on right now, my empathic self is having a little bit of a hard time staying focused and um, sharp. So today is going to be a little bit of a self-care divine kind of day for myself. So I won't be doing a pick a pile, but I will be doing a collective energy reading because I need one for myself. And I think everybody out there probably wants one too. So I've picked one card already. I have the deck here and we're going to do some more. Um, heads up, I did read this card already. And that's why I pulled out this camera. I was like, if I pull this card, I need to share. At first, I was only going to take a photo, but I realized this deserves a video. So the card for the collective today, the Cosmic Egg. The Cosmic Egg, by the way, I'm using the um, Animal Spirit by Kim Kranz. Oh, Kranz, sorry. <coughs> so, the Cosmic Egg is the symbolization for a new dimension, a new earth, a completion, a new age, which is literally what today is. So, I thought this card was literally the most amazing card for us to receive today. It was almost like it was a confirmation from above, letting me, letting me know, like, you feel a lot of stuff going on today because there's this whole cosmicness of the universe happening right now and we're all kind of getting thrown into this. And if you're feeling a little bit imbalanced today, I'm sure you can probably blame it on this as well. I was feeling really great up until this morning and something about now, this morning up until now, my brain feels a little bit like it's in a flutter. <laughs> so um, I'm really gonna meditate and try to relax after this and just do some monology studying. But this is an amazing card for us to get. And let's pull a couple more cards out. Um, whenever I do these kind of cards, I just kind of let um, cards kind of fall out and whatever kind of comes out to me um, is the card that I pull. The Firefly. This card is saying, don't forget that our happiness is coming from within us right now. Um, there's a lot of darkness in our world, but what is going to be helping us with this ascension into the fifth dimension is going to be that light that we have in our souls. I'm like getting really warm in my um, heart chakra right now. Like I'm feeling really like, Ooh. Um, this is an amazing, beautiful card. You can really see that um, lightness within and remember that you are the bearer of your own light. You don't need somebody to tell you that. Um, you don't need the approval or of your parents, of your loved ones, of your boss, of your spouse, of anybody because your light is within you and finding this light is really going to help us get to this fifth dimension. Let's do a couple more. I really feel a spirit with me right now. Eagle, wow. The eagle's powerful. The eagle is driven. So this is saying to make sure we are manifesting everything we want right now. The power is in your hands. The creation is in your hands. Your life is in your own hands. This is saying be motivated, be determined. You can make your life how you want it to. The eagle is a very powerful bird. Um, and the eagle reminds us that we are on the top of the food chain, so to speak, in the sense that we can do so much with our lives and we have so much potential. So let's tune into that ego-driven energy and just be here and be present in the moment, feeling who we are on the inside, being the strong, being strong, being determined. It was going to help us with this ascension. Oh, look at that. The tarantula. This is actually a card I haven't gotten yet, so let's take a look. <laughs> the tarantula, it represents a moment when a great decision must be made. So, this is actually really interesting because it's basically saying your ego probably knows that there's a choice that is needing to be made in your life. I am feeling this sense of probably something you need to let go of that you're not ready to but your soul already knows like your soul is aware that there needs to be a change and something needs to kind of be done but this is definitely like I feel like a self 
love self-care kind of thing involved to this so i really believe there's like a change that needs to happen within yourself um in your core belief system that is really going to help with today's energies um then also because of the suitor um, the suitor the saturn and jupiter um great conjunction today it's the best time to declare what you're letting go of what you won't be doing anymore in the future this card is literally saying that like changes need to be made make them now let's pull just one more card i like uneven numbers when it comes to cards so let's get a fifth one in there oh oh my goodness the swan the swan live your life with grace be conscious of who you are don't give up on yourself and just really be present and enjoy the simplicity that life is going to bring you and the peace that is going to bring you like you can just visually see the peace of this card compared to the others it's a perfect final card it's almost like all of this can lead to this like serenity and peace and almost like finesse that the swan brings into everyone's life so um I believe that's a beautiful uh, last card to kind of finish us off. So a small recap, we are going through an ascension right now. There's a lot of energy. Make sure that you're keeping your light from within to not allow those negative energies and the energy shift in general, get to your personal energy field and space. Make sure that you're determined and driven with your goals because now is the right time to manifest these things with winter solstice. And with the great conjunction, let's make sure that we're letting go of the things that no longer serve us. That's gonna be key. And in the end, we are going to get to that grace and that beauty, but we have to make sure that we're being mindful of who we are, watching ourselves, and just really filling up our life with the things that we want, because we are the reflection that matters the most for our lives. So I hope that this reading spoke with you today. I'm like astounded by the way it came out, because this is literally all of the focuses that we need to do for today, the 21st of December. It's a lot of big energy with winter solstice or Yule, however you call it, and um, also the um, Great Conjunction. Um, please leave a message down below, a comment, find me on Instagram or YouTube, and please let me know how you connected with this because I'm not going to lie, like... As soon as I saw the cosmic egg, I just felt like I needed to do a reading with these cards. I had a whole other plan and I wasn't even going to film this. And I was like, let's turn the freaking camera on because this card means a lot today. Um, I hope you guys have an amazing, amazing rest of your day today. And um, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye. Happy conjunction.